thank you all for coming and sharing with me this this day. <laughs> um, so I had planned on giving a retirement speech, and I quickly changed my mind <laughs> after that emotional ramblings that I had at the town hall meeting two weeks ago. I was so emotional. But um, then I thought, what is a retirement party without the honored guest giving a speech? I mean, it's expected, and it's the right thing to do. So here I am. I finally have made it. <laughs> um, after 53 plus years, I'm standing here today at the end of my government career, a career that has spanned over five decades. How many people can say that? And as I end this part of my journey through life, I'm looking forward to spending my days in Cannon Beach, putting a yard that I have planned for the past several years together that is, if the deer don't eat it first. <laughs> um, looking back over my government career, my extensive career, I'm so thankful I started my career at the Justice Department in 1964 in Washington, D.C. Bobby Kennedy was Attorney General at that time, and I had the privilege of meeting him. It was um, truly uh, a thrill. Uh, a young girl right out of high school going to work in big, big government was, was thrilling for me. Um, I've worked for many government agencies over the years, uh, GSA and Auburn, where I worked for 14 and a half years and then got RIFT. And for those who don't know what RIFT means, it's a reduction in force. Um, so then I went to Boeing Field at FAA. And, for, and then uh, um, my husband and I both married and we moved to Charleston, South Carolina, where I went to work for the Polaris Missile Facility for a brief time. And then um, after that, um, I went to work for the FAA Charleston Air Traffic Control Tower. Mm -hmm. And I worked there for five years. I loved it. And after Hurricane Hugo, um, it destroyed some of the um, Department of Transportation buildings. And I got rift again. So for most people, I think that would be a big turning point. Uh, but for me, um, I put in so many years. At, at that point, I'd had over 20 years. So um, I started to work for the uh, VA in Charleston, South Carolina in a laboratory service, working alongside the surgical pathologist and the laboratory team uh, in 1990. Um, in 1993, after moving back to uh, Seattle, I started working for the Seattle VA. Um, I worked in the primary care, working for the head of the department, Dr. Stephen Finn. And when he moved up to uh, HSRMD to be the director, um, I went up there to uh, work with him as his personal assistant for many years. Um, I can honestly say that in the 28 years that I, I have worked for the VA, there hasn't been a day that I didn't want to come to work because I love my job and I enjoy working with people here. What a blessing that is to be able to say that at the end of your career. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, this is just a very emotional time for me. I'm, I'm thrilled to be leaving. I'm, I'm thrilled that I'm at this point, that I'm healthy, I have a wonderful home to go to, but it's really hard. And it's hard to say goodbye, but I know that it's it's time for me to go. And I will miss all of you. I feel as though I work with the very best here in Seattle. The doctors are the best of the best. And it has been an honor and a privilege to have been a part of helping the many thousands of veterans receive the care that they so deserve. And I'm so thrilled that I have touched so many lives. I, I just, so many veterans. And I am proud to say that I am, that I gave my all for the betterment of those that are, who have won the battle. Thank you so much for the nine years here in the pulmonary department. I will cherish the memories. You have been like my second family, supporting me in my career and in my personal life. You know the ups and downs and the frustrations that I felt while building our cottage in Cannon Beach. Thank you 
for Lincoln lending an ear during that time. But now the house is complete and it's time for me to go. I'm going to miss all of you. I'm looking forward to having the time and the freedom to pursue my hobbies and to plant my yard. <laughs> Thank you for sharing my journey and I'm onward to the next adventure. Thank you. Yeah. Bye.